Many, many years ago, they anticipated people probably would not be in such good spelling form down here, so they came up with this, <laughs> a smile. You don't need to spell it right. That's you right. just need to have one. We have one as we've gathered for the 46th time along the Lakefront Summerfest 2013. Ted Perry along with Mary Stoker Smith. That's right. The 11 day gig kicked off today, the big gig as it's known. And boy, what a great crowd, great weather, and just a great vibe today to start everything off. The only thing different this year, there are some new attractions, but a little bit of concern about what you can bring in a Summerfest. In fact, when I walked through, I'm sure you saw this a lot of water bottles at the front gate as you gave your ticket. So don't bring any water down here. In fact, you got to be a little bit careful about your, what you bring in. But you know, you don't want to be weighed down with a lot of stuff, right? You just kind of want to enjoy. Travel as light as you can, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Our Justin uh, Williams took a look at exactly uh, what the new security measures will mean for you this year. Things have changed. Mike DeMarco started working Summerfest security 17 years ago. And all this is just a uh, result of what's been happening in the, uh, you know, in the United States and, and in the world in general. This year, during Summerfest 2013, DeMarco, now a Summerfest security consultant, says one of those changes involves bags in a box. We have a box at each gate, and you need to fit it into that box to be able to bring it on the ground. And then it's on top of that, it will be searched. If your bag does not fit, you do have other options. Anybody with an oversized bag can bring it to the grounds. They need to check it when they get here. They have one of those check locations, and there's one at each, each gate. DeMarco reminds Summerfest fans that all bags will be checked upon entry and that unattended bags should be reported under Summerfest's new see something, say something policy. You see something that looks out of place, mention it to somebody and we'll look at it or the police will look at it. So far, the new Summerfest security measures are sitting well with those in attendance, many of whom say a lot of extra caution is well worth a little extra time. I feel safer when they check bags and things like that. You have no idea what could be brought in these days. It was no hassle at all and, uh, you know, I think it's a very good policy. I spoke with several people coming through the south gates here at the Summerfest grounds today and not one of them complained about having to have their bag checked or having to check their bag if it was too big for the box. By the way, that box measures 12 inches by 9 inches by 9 inches for those of you who are planning to try to pack it in down here at Summerfest. That's the latest from the south end. I'm Justin Williams, Fox 6 News. All right, Justin, thanks. How do they talk, Justin, out of not doing a story involving food? That's oh, what I don't get. I, if you check my Twitter feed, I walked into <laughs> Summerfest. The first person I saw, Justin Williams, with an empty plate. Uh, so, you know, it's funny you say that. I knew it. Yeah, I knew don't it. worry. Yeah. He's, he's eaten. Absolutely. He had great weather today.